Okay, so, um, this is the end. I'm just gonna jump right into it. This is the end, um, it's a newer movie, and I think it, it's a comedy, really, like, it's a comedy, but I think it falls under, uh, my horror movie thing, because, um, well, it's kind of scary, too. It's got some scary things to it. It's the end of the world. Um, and, you know, it's all about survival, too. They gotta survive the end of the world. It's gonna get really bright, I'm sorry. I'm walking. But, um, they gotta try and survive through the end of the world. Just stop for a second. And, um, it's got, uh, Seth Rogen and James... Franco, or Franco, or however you say his last name, I'm not sure. Um, and, uh, other people whose names I don't know. <laughs> um, but it's really good. It's really funny. I thought it was great. I, I laughed through the whole thing. And, yeah, you know, it's, there's some really shocking points in the, there are some really shocking points to the movie. And, it's, well, it's got some pretty vulgar language to it, so if you don't like that, you might not want to check it out, but isn't that pretty, it's pretty cool. I really like it. Um, I, uh, I said, there's not too much to say about the movie that I really like. I can't really totally go into the whole detail of the movie like I have been with some because well, I really like the movie, and it's one of those movies that, you know, it's newer, so I can't really say much, because a lot of people might not have seen it. Uh, it is out on DVD, um, if you want to check it out. I would say that it would be worth buying. I would buy it, um, but, because I didn't buy it, it was just rented, but I would buy it. <laughs> um, hmm, what else can I say about this film? I I was pretty surprised by it because the, the in the movie it's really neat because all the actors are playing themselves whether it be an exaggerated version of themselves or they're acting with their own name I don't know because <laughs> I don't know them but I do know that if that is how some of them actually are in real life I probably would not want to meet them <laughs> but um, it's, uh, I, I, it is really funny, it's really good, and, like I said, I don't even, if you look it up, it probably doesn't even classify as a horror, and if you watch it, you probably wouldn't even see it as a horror, I still think it fits the bill, because it does have a horror kind of feel to it, it's just the end of the world, it's got some, I would say spooky points. There's some things in there that are pretty crazy that they could put in a real horror movie, I would say. And really, you know, there's a lot of stuff in it that that it could be put in a horror movie. They just kind of make it goofy for comic, you know, comedy, for the comic relief of it. But all together, they could take the same concept of a movie and make it into something really, really scary if they wanted to. And so... You know, that's why I chose this one. Plus, like I said, I really liked it, and I really wanted to talk about it. And, um, I think that they should probably do more movies this way. I think it's really cool how they put, you know, they played them they, themselves. It wasn't just, like, characters. They didn't play somebody with a different name or whatever. But they, it's like, you know, I think it'd be better that way. They could really put themselves into a situation being just their selves, rather than having to pretend to, be, pretend to be somebody else. And I think it's a really neat way to, uh, to make a movie like that. I like the idea. And I, th I, I really enjoyed it. I thought it was really funny and really cool. And, uh, it, it was just really good. It had a great ending, beginning, middle, everything about it. I don't think there was anything about it I really didn't like. Um, you know, it, it did get weird. At some points, though, actually, if I were to pick out something I didn't like, they... <laughs> but that's another thing that's interesting, too, is that, I mean, they can have real conversation. It's, it didn't really feel like, you know, they're reading lines off of a script or whatever, but 
you know, you get in goofy fights with a friend or whatever, and they got in some goofy fights in the film. Um, so, yeah, I, I enjoyed it. I'll give it a 9. I'll give it a 9 out of 10. Um, and, uh, I do, you know, recommend that you check it out. It's really funny. Like I said, it's, it does have vulgar languages and stuff in it. I wouldn't let your, you know, little kids or, or younger family members watch it. <laughs> but it's, it's a pretty good film. Um, let's see, what else? Oh, yeah, I guess I should tell you that if you like the video, you could, uh, subscribe to my channel. You could like this video, comment on it, share it so that other people can see it. Oh yeah, when you comment it, of course, comment with a horror movie suggestion, a horror TV show suggestion, or a horror music video suggestion. And I'll check those out, and I'll review those, too. Um, I will say I'm pretty excited, uh, because I think I mentioned before I'm going to be doing a video game channel, too, on YouTube here soon. Maybe within the next week or two, and I'm hoping that the first game that I get to do it on, I'm hoping it'll be The Wolf Among Us, which is going to be pretty cool. I don't know anything about it. Like, the one and only thing I know about it is that, like, you're a werewolf, and that's it. I don't know anything else. <laughs> um, so there's that to look forward to, too. <laughs> um, yeah, there you go. I hope you like this video, and I will have another one up within two weeks. Thanks for watching.